Common problems in topology optimization. Today, Ted Grove parameters. Um, maybe you don't have really come across that feature, but tetrahedrons have uh, usually a growth parameter set, which is kind of a hurdle for topology optimization. Let me show you why. Let's say you want to mesh something like this structure here. And I have two of that because I want to show you the differences. Um, and you want to have it with tetrahedrons, which is not really necessary here because it's a mappable structure. You could go just with solid map and mesh it and then you're all good. But let's say it would be something like a little bit more complicated. But you go ahead and just select Tetra, select the solid, select mesh, and fine, right? Um, what you in this case missed is that there is a somewhat hidden um, parameter, which is called the Tet Grove parameter, uh, which you can see if I just go with the element selector and hide a bunch of elements and not show the geometry, you can see that, that on the surface, the element size is what you wanted, and then it grows and grows and grows. If you want to have a analysis of the structure, because of the high stresses are typically on the surface, it's not the problem. And it's a good thing because you have less elements in the zones where you don't expect a lot of stress. But topology optimization is a different kind of animal. Here, you want to have a some sort of homogeneous structure because you want to have also the possibility to create thin structures in the middle of your design space, right? So you can see that here. Now let's let me show you what I mean uh, with the top with the Ted Grove parameter. Um, if I just click again on mesh and here on the menu, and you can see it here, the growth rate. Let's set that to 1.0, which means it does not grow. And mesh it again. This will also result in more elements. Suggest so that you know that's uh, trivial, but yeah. Uh, don't forget about that. And I will again just hide a little bit of the elements and you can see how it's looking inside. So for topology optimization, if you use a TED mesh, please, please, please go to the TED mesh and set this option to 1.0 because then you can see the, the structures here will be far better than it is here. All right, that's all for today. Thanks, guys, and have a good one.